back to the daily grind thanks for checking out the channel make sure to hit subscribe if you're new and hit thumbs up if you're not a baby back bagel biting bitch boy because you know what time it is it's full time mma money management is a hell of a drug conor mcgregor is suggesting that floyd mayweather was ripped off by showtime and now he needs to rematch him for money now this is really interesting, especially if you take into consideration the back and forth that's been going on between the UFC and Showtime, where the UFC, Dana White and Conor McGregor are claiming that they broke the record, they broke all the pay-per-view numbers and all the records, number one pay-per-view draw of all time and all of that nonsense, while Showtime is coming out and saying, no, actually you guys took like second place. Now even the MMA media, who some casuals might assume is on Dana White and Conor McGregor's side, are being unbiased and saying, actually... Dana White and Connor are probably lying just because if you take into consideration Showtime is a publicly traded company so Showtime they have to reveal their actual numbers the real numbers while the UFC is a privately owned company and so they don't actually have to reveal the real numbers they can just come out and say hey we broke the record everybody believe us and we will never actually know if we don't see the numbers so Showtime is probably not lying the you you know Connor McGregor and Floyd Mayweather probably didn't take number one of all time as far as pay-per-view sales are concerned but hey number two is you know it's, you still made some money that's not really even that big of a deal to me unless you're taking into consideration what conor mcgregor is suggesting now that floyd mayweather is being ripped off by showtime and that's why they're lying about the numbers conor mcgregor is suggesting that showtime is lying about the numbers so they don't have to pay floyd mayweather what he's really earned like, so let's say Floyd Mayweather got 50% of the pay-per-views just to make this easy. And, you know, they sold 10 million pay-per-views. Showtime's like, no, we only sold 8 million pay-per-views. So they only have to pay Floyd, you know, Floyd less money. So Conor McGregor, that's what Conor McGregor is suggesting. Now, I don't think that's the case. Although, if I wanted to put on my team MMA, Conor McGregor, Fook the Mayweather hat, I would say, Floyd, Floyd. You need to go check Showtime. See, get, get your paperwork right. You probably missed something in the paperwork the first time. You didn't realize that, you know what I'm saying? So you need to go get your lawyers or whoever to do the paperwork for you. That way you get your right money and you ain't going to have to rematch McGregor, which it's looking like. Because not only did Floyd Mayweather or could Floyd Mayweather have got ripped off by Showtime, the motherfucking IRS ain't never stopped motherfucking, you know, at his neck. He probably half of his Conor McGregor money probably went to taxes the other half he probably got ripped off by showtime and now floyd mayweather you know his jets need gas and he's gonna have to fight conor mcgregor sooner rather than later and you know that could be what happens no i'm just fucking around but all jokes aside this rematch could realistically happen i mean uh chel sonnen one of the first people to confirm floyd mayweather and the conor mcgregor one was happening back when a lot of people thought it wasn't happening he's confirmed floyd mayweather will be fighting again now who's it against who knows but it's likely to be conor mcgregor and taking into consideration conor mcgregor's hiatus from mma he has not fought MMA in over 420 days. Shout out to Lemon Hoko Genetics. But um, he's also, you know, hasn't fought MMA since he fought Floyd Mayweather. And a lot of people, you know, he's about maybe getting stripped of his belt soon as he hasn't defended. He's got to defend or vacate his belt. There's two, uh, an interim champion and another number one contender that are already going to be fighting for Conor's belt soon, which means he's likely to get stripped. Now, if Conor does get stripped of his belt, he's likely to either fight Nate Diaz or Floyd Mayweather next. And with Floyd Mayweather possibly having money problems or Floyd Mayweather just wanting to fight again, Conor McGregor's a very likely opponent. So with that being said, it is what it is. Conor McGregor suggesting Floyd Mayweather got ripped off by Showtime, and that's why they're lying about the numbers, so they don't really have to pay him everything he's earned. And since he didn't get everything he earned, now he needs money for a rematch. Hey, it's, it's new. Last time it, he said he needed the money for taxes, now he needs it because Showtime ripped him off. Either way, looking like Floyd Mayweather needs some money, and we might be seeing Conor McGregor versus Floyd Mayweather too in 2018. Holy smokes. Let the full-time family know what you think in the comments. I'm out. Da 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 da! It's the motherfucking D O double G.